Next, please. How about Mr. Barrels? If you'll be so kind and unmute yourself. Uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Um, good evening uh, now. <laughs> yeah, good evening. It's over midnight in Europe. Um, um, good afternoon, Madam Chair and uh, members of the committee. My name is Laszlo G. Bors, and I am a retired UCLA research professor of pediatrics. I'm a biochemist physician, and I talk for myself. Thank you for this opportunity. RNA-based vaccination technologies, nevertheless, the mandating of them, need to be reevaluated, reconsidered, and likely banned from human use based on a recent scientific discovery. This is because the old dogma does not hold any longer that the transcription of genes occurs only from DNA to RNA in human cells. Polymerase theta was discovered in 2021 with the primary function of reversely transcribing RNA to DNA. The discovery of human polymerase theta alarms against chemically modified and stabilized RNA injections as they can be templates of this enzyme and they may serve as a, as a transcribable information into constitutionally active gene constructs. These constructs may harm human cells in many different ways by inducing cancer and debilitating severe inflama inflammation, among others. And this may explain some of the symptoms and the seven page side effect list from Pfizer. Scientists literally need to go back to figure out how modifying and stabilizing RNA impacts the human genome via polymerase data. They need to clarify also how long stabilized and injected messenger RNA persists in the presence of deuterium, which is a heavy stable hydrogen isotope in biological water solvents, also altering the RNA template fidelity of polymerase data. I believe that mRNA vaccine technologies are spiraling mankind into the biggest scientific and health disasters anyone has ever seen. Thank you very much. Thank you. And can you tell me where you are <laughs> testifying from? You said that it's midnight in Europe. <clears throat> I'm in Hungary right now. All right. Wow, that's commitment. Well, thank you for staying up and being with us. It really, uh, we really appreciate it. Thank um, you so much. Thank you. Are there any questions for this witness? Well, thank you. And I hope you can go to bed now and get some rest. Thank you. My pleasure. Um, next, please. 